Hello everyone, the Green Man Bookseller here and this is another book review video and it's time I'm going to be talking about this book The Diary of a Bookseller by Sean Biffle hope I pronounced his surname correctly uh, This book was given to me on the first day that I ran my bookstall at Shaftesbury Market, Thursday Market and it was given to me by a gentleman called Kerry He's a gentleman that runs the local This Is Alfred Facebook page and This Is Alfred radio station for the Shaftesbury area. He picked this book up from the local Oxfam bookshop and gave it to me as a little gift for like my first day as a bookseller myself. Uh, Sean Biffel, he's a bookshop owner. He owns a shop up in Wigtown, which he's... Owned, I think it's 2001 he bought the bookshop and been running it ever since if I remember rightly and this obviously this is his diary this particular book he put together this is covering the year 2014 I think he's done at least a couple more books since then of a similar similar vein basically yeah it's a a diary a year in a a life of him running his book. Oh, oh yeah, <laughs> got a couple of got a couple of train tickets in the front. Just one drop back. <laughs> anyway, sorry about that. <laughs> so this is a sort of a, a year in the life of Sean running his bookshop over the course of the year twenty fourteen. <laughs> and I must admit, it was it was a very interesting read. I very I found it very gripping. I mean, probably a, a large part of that is because I've just started selling books myself. So <laughs> it, was, it was kind of like reading this book, it was a bit like an insight into what I've got to look forward to, what I've got coming for me sort of as I progress in my, in my life as a bookseller. So, but I mean, even if you're not a bookseller yourself, this is, I, it'd still be an interesting read, I'd say. So it's like I said, he's basically laid it out as it as a diary, as he's and all the rest. So I suppose it, you could look at it as a similar vein to the um, the Adrian Mole diaries. Now that's going to age me a bit, isn't it? Talking about Adrian Mole, that's a um, character from the eighties. But I mean, whereas the diaries of Adrian Mole are about a fictitious character. This diary is about a real life person. He's like writing about, uh, about his life and that. So I thought I'm definitely got to get my hands on his other two books. I so I think it's at least two, definitely two more he's written since this, from what I've seen. So I'm definitely going to get them as well and have a good old read of them. But I thoroughly enjoyed this. Thoroughly enjoyed it. It was a real good read. So yes, if you like reading, sort of diary style books and if you enjoy reading about sort of like the lives of booksellers and all the rest and you like to have a little bit of an insight into what it's like being a bookseller i would definitely recommend getting your hands on a copy of this book and having a read because it is very funny very good very brilliant i enjoyed it very much anyway guys thank you for watching hope you've enjoyed Look forward to seeing you in the next video and in the meantime, the usual, stay safe, happy reading.